So him said to himself, oh, he has weakened the opposition. Now him can't carry names. Him not for declare no assets. Him can't change this a person from senator to this, to that, to Ray, to Tay. It's like to him, power is in his hands. And the very fact, the very fact that he now has some opposition, he never seen him have opposition before. It's like him has said to himself now, so that boy, you want to come take me through it. He, you know him start getting them feelings, Marvin. Never seen always. him before. Always. We have always. never and seen him like this, Jamaica, until he recognized him have any competition. It's because Mark Golding, with the local government election, what do you mean I'm feeling still? We 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 glorify scamming, we glorify badmanism, we, we, we give our very prime minister bad man name, right? And 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 the man take this country. We but you see the truth is Andrew Olness mm -hmm. and the the other 62 members of parliament, you can't blame them for how they are behaving because we the people we are we employed them and we've done nothing for years we have seen the blatant disrespect disregard for morals and values and for good governance just flushed down the toilet thrown in our faces and we do nothing about it it's business as usual i hear we oh me and that's why i'm in a business in a politics me that's why i'm in a vote when i hear this and even now when the observer or the gleaner put out anything in the when you see Jamaicans in the comment sections, labor right across PMP, PMP across labor right over some dirty atrocities that you would have thought, be it PMP or labor right who commit the crime, that you would have both persons or both parties saying, no man. This is this is not good. But instead you have the don't labor right them who come out and say, um, well, it depends on which side. Are they don't PMP them who come out and say, ah, oh, when PMP, when PMP did in a power, on an air, so nothing, so leave the man alone. Like, we're talking about a crime that the man commit. And yes, so if you leave him alone, if, um, and, and, and vice, and vice versa. And then the, when you look in the comment section, if those people could literally shoot each other in the comment section, Mr. PP, that dead in the comment section. The level of hatred that Jamaicans still have as it relates to who is PMP from who is JLP. 12%, if you go up on Google and type in the illiteracy rate in Jamaica, it tell you 88.1. Are we literate? Right? Yeah, so basically, 12% are the country. 12% are the country. Illiterate. 12% based upon how them do the or based on how them do the percentage, them do it from 15 year old, 15 years and older, which amounts to 2.4 million of the present population. When you do the 12% out of that, you're talking about 299,000 Jamaicans are illiterate. 299,000. We should have had a constitution that protects the people that says, listen, less than 50% votes, the election, I forgot, oh, we have to go do back over election. We, what we have in parliament now is a reflection of the 12%, is a reflection of the 33% who voted. A 33%. We have a minority government leading the people. Um, Jamaica, it is time for those of you who want to vote on the need to go out go vote. There are 70 percent. Me no know about all about me. I use Andre platform. We did it. The independent only for the love of God only get independent a chance. But Andrew Michael Olness and his shenanigans cannot continue in this country. His anansism cannot continue in in the country. The theatrics that we've been seeing cannot continue. The crime the corruption cannot yes. continue for people who are collecting millions of dollars for taxpayer is sick and tired of uno at a time for the country black every word sick of uno. so ishmael come thursday what do you think matt golding should do what do i think um, I think it's highly disrespectful for, for me to be presenting and you just get up and you walk out. 
So I I am in agreement with you, Andre. Not for gonna wear brother. Mood never show up. So you're calling for the opposition to stay away from Parliament on Thursday? Yeah. As a caucus. Don't go nowhere. You led, you led, you led um, you led your 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 government to walk out because you felt an emotional inclination to get up and leave. Never mind the people's business. Yes, the three hundred percent increase. Yeah, man. Never mind whatever is happening. You decide, say, because a man hurt your feelings. Yeah, get up and you go walk. You go talk. Whatever it is you want to. Talk. Um, Can you imagine if Michael Leachin was to do that? That when him when him there in board meeting, Patrick Hilton hurt him feelings. Just take up and just walk out. As Can the you owner imagine? Of a bank? Brother, we are saying, man, about her feelings. This is why I keep telling emotions have no place in, in logics. It don't have no place in facts. The facts are the facts. So if it is that you don't like something, it don't matter how you feel about it at the end of the day, the fact will remain the same. So the man talk, look at truth and it burn you. I just, I just saw it go. So we know what? You be a man and sit down and take your truth and then you rebut it and say anything you want to say. Um, so we can't have something for talk, or Andre can't so, have something for talk for Thursday. But you decide, decide. No, I mean, what's your take? What should not going on the opposition do on Thursday? Listen to me, it's simple, and we don't want a one day protest, not going nowhere. And we're not just not gonna show up, we're calling for the resignation of the Prime Minister of Jamaica. That me, that me, I ask her, the time come, the resignation of the Prime Minister. For disrespecting wow. the Jamaican people. And so disrespecting, and disrespecting. What are we? What do you mean if a resignation we are called for? It's not just because of him just walk out. We need to know who are the six teeth. You put your guard upon people and you're still collecting our money every month. You only still collect free money. Only still a guard grows to go buy three and four trolley. Only pick your guard the best hospital. I don't know how to do all kind of things. And the country, we still not on a good road. Election call a long time. Election call, I don't know. Claim so no win. It won't then start fix yet. When you made your presentation in December, you tell you tell the people them say by the second week of January, every part, every, every the MP is supposed program. to sub, submit submit on, on a report. No. <laughs> one hundred and you said one hundred and fifty million per MP yeah. to fix every road. A march in our march almost done, and the road now fixed because on a tech with idiot. The theatrics, the lies, the corruption will wear the damn resignation. Sick are you? Sick are you? As a matter of fact, and all the Jamaicans who are defending you. Can you put up that poll? Should the Prime Minister resign in light of this behavior in the Parliament today? As a matter of fact, I know the man that talk about Vibes Cartel. I know the man that come out and talk about Vibes Cartel as the Prime Minister. Vibes Cartel should have done right now. Vibes Cartel needs to be out there. Marvin! Oh, Marvin, no. Marvin, there is a rule of law. The, no, Prime Minister can, the Prime Minister can't release my vibes cartel, Marvin. I didn't say him to release him. I didn't say to release him. But an international... An international... Listen to me. An international... Andre, we need a Prime Minister. We need a Prime Minister. Now tell me about no rule of law or no nothing. You understand? Yeah. The Privy Council quash a matter where we've had a Jamaican citizen... Me no, listen me, I don't know if cartel kill lizard or not. Me no, me no, no fan. I am for the I am for the respect of a Jamaican citizen that the law should protect everybody. It could have been you, mm. it could have been Ishmael, it could have been me. Where we the evidence wanna have the this are tampered with, the jury tamper with, every goddamn thing tamper with. A white man who not forget one judge, a how much much white man to tell we say, oh by the way. Um, a man should need a prison so long still in the dark on the need to should have thrown that case there and the man him still in a prison and now Paul Lewin is, is pushing earnestly to have a retrial retrial on the back side but that's retrial what I like what? Me, Marvin I retrial Marvin what Prime Marvin you come far man let me tell you Marvin something you know Andre you do not understand yes. how Jamaica run you know I understand how Jamaica run. I understand Vibes Cartel is sick. Whether I'm sick or not, we're talking about a justice system that the entire world have seen the flaws and corruption in a... As a matter of fact, the, the prosecution and the judge 
will go ahead with that the case there and sentence a man like that need to hang what and you hear me say on a sick stomach because the justice system needs to have equal rights equal justice for every jamaican and if you go listen to me we are yeah, playing with the country yes. hello mr yes. una play with the country yes, wow. as a matter of fact the judge and the prosecution should have been fired immediately immediately they yes, said justice let us camera must be fired we say immediately and Paula Llewellyn must be fired and Jeremy Taylor must be well, fired. Uh, listen, Lord. well, we know Paula Llewellyn will never be fired because Paula Llewellyn is the, is the baby of this administration. She's the only person, the only law person who then get the entire law amended for so she can stay around a little longer to drive with friggin' crazy. Listen to me. Let me tell you this enough. Let me tell you this enough. Yes, yes Jamaica. Jamaica, like we we <laughs> cannot have a country. We cannot have a country where you cannot trust the justice system. You cannot trust our parliamentarians who we are paying millions of dollars. As a matter of fact, who tell you how much money they're going to give themselves. Then they ask, we, we didn't have a committee that sit and says, we have to discuss it, we have to put it to the Jamaican people. We were told, it come and say, oh, we did this. Our teachers were asking for twenty percent. Oh no, I wonder why so much teacher are dead. Eh? You think you think kind of damn stress? You think that stress alone will kill the teacher? Then what uh, the vax, the vaccine. Uh, no, you think no, people no, are no, idiots. The job, the job, the job. Did uh, anything they want causing? No, uh, no. Jamaicans only not understand what going in the country. You know. When you can have our Minister of Finance coming in, in a budget debate, they are telling you now, what if things are going And you are going to tell, we say, you're happy to remove GCT from imported raw goods, vegetables, and fruits. When we already hear it, it all that public knowledge that said Bill Gates are putting vaccine in a vegetable, the same foreign vegetable. Allegedly. 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 Hello. Allegedly. Yo. Come lock me up, me say, me say, it must show me vaccine, in a it. Allegedly. I want this family man guarantee. Yo, now, you, know, you see the problem we doing in you know, Andre. Andre, you know, support the nasty this, you know. Let me tell you we something, you know. What nasty this man? What do you mean? Because when I feel to talk about them looking wicked, evil people, you know, we sit and go about them over, we you know. Me, me a God fearing you, you know. Me is a God fearing you, you know. And one time I see evil, me have to call it evil. The country mm. is in a mess. And the, the, the Minister of Finance is going to make a statement that they had to remove the tax or else face economic economic sanctions from the IMF. Who would the backside sign that a paper there that Jamaica now is put into a position where our local farmers can't go grow nothing and we have to free up international food come here? Eh? Mm. Who signed so that the speak. bill? I don't really saw it go. So oh, it go. So, uh, oh, it go. The, the, oh, it go. The, 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 the finance minister in... In my, in my trickster. So I don't really no. how, it, how, it is, how it is that. Uh, oh, yeah. God, Tell them right. what Tell me. So Tell there me. is in fact, there is in fact um, a letter that was sent to the government that if they if they don't do something about it, um, there can be sanctions. However, just like any um, jurisprudence, there is there is a board to ventilate the issue. He never did have to do it. He never did have to do it. That is the, that is the truth. He did it because Sir. he wanted to. So they say that a letter come and them 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 take the letter if do that. The letter so, so, so I'm saying the sanction part is in fact true. Um, if we didn't do it, if, if we didn't do it, we would be sanctioned. But the letter Ishmael. didn't say that we would be sanctioned. No, well, I know the letter didn't say that we would be sanctioned. No, one and two, there is a particular tribunal from the World yes. Trade Organization that deals with these issues and that they can be ventilated. Him decide say him now nah, go this up. So it's not that we would be sanctioned and the sanction would last for, 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 for a lifetime sort of thing. Uh -huh. That's you, not you, want me, you want me to stir up Antsness one one last minute and then we come off an Andre program. Let me tell you what Uno no know. Because you said you uno sit down and just take on the ear pan news. Let me tell you what I go on because you know. I know me know why me at yeah. the brother. Well on the Virgin, you know how much documents then the people assign. What the country don't know about. You know what documents then the people assign? You see how the same that is Samoa, the Samoa agreement there. Eh? You see how the yeah. agreement there? Eh? Let me tell you something, you know. Only not understand. 
Una understand the evil. We see the what they say now. Una understand the evil, you know. And I'm going to tell you this. The farmers, whether you like it or not, you have to go to the farm store to buy the grains. You know where the grains come from? U.S. Did you know that the grains that you buy, once it's planted, it cannot be replanted? You didn't know that? Yeah. Why? Because them come and them, them come in our country and, uh, and cause scientifically mash up with agriculture, mash up, mash up. Well, we can't replant nothing. We have to come to them for grains. That simply means if we not do what they say, they are going to eat all grains from we are going to starve. We don't need to read. We don't need to understand what America do. America need to mind them business and come out of the country. We get food from um, Marvin. Benjamin. But uh, America run everybody head. May I tell you that? That is the same thing they were trying with Russia. When did you know that Russia and Ukraine were responsible for for a large percentage of the a percentage of the wheat that we grow? Only didn't know that. And green a and large green percentage green. of the wheat, the wheat will come, and that's and why them they green. tell Russia, and that's why them said they may not put up economic sanctions against Russia because them try to hold everybody by the balls. Only oh. understand how America go on and manipulate everybody. They did it with Nicaragua. One time them pies now for people and banana. Only go dig up on the research. You know the banana industry get mashed up. Every I'm now we have a gas supermarket and I'm dirty foreign banana. Hmm? We have a foreign onion. We have every god thing. We are importing six to one and we're comfortable with that. You know how much local farmers get mashed up. Only know how much local farmers can send them picnic at school and we have the land. We have the water. We have gold. We have sea tree metal in Jamaica and mine the gold. Mine gold. Gold. It's 28,000 US dollars for one pound of gold. And our Prime Minister Andrew Wallace and his administration are going to make a deal on behalf of the Jamaican people. And they're asking for 5% out of 100 years. Actually, 5%. 5 And our teachers want money. Our policemen want money. Our fire people want money. Mm -hmm. On the top of the country, I run good and prosperity. And you take up 750 acre land, the Chinese. This evening, I was in Maypen. Let me tell you now, come off an Andre program. And this evening, me jump out of my car in front of two municipal police who me out there literally uh, almost uh, assault one woman who in a Maypen, everybody know her. She have one trolley and she have a big old pot where she cooks some food. And the woman a ball because the tell her, say, you can't die or so. So me come out and me say hello. When she finished, she not in her road. She the right on the roadside. She not bother Uno. I want to come out and want to take her little food. Me say Uno know how much. Me say look at the buildings around Uno. Every last building there so is owned by a Chinese. Every last ninety percent, ninety percent of our business is owned in Jamaica. It's owned by foreign personnel by Chinese. While Jamaicans have to sit and watch a Chinese push key in a lock and go sit down in an air conditioned building while we sit outside. We can't get a decent loan to go open the business card and now give me a you. Them Jamaicans have to sit down outside. I sell, I sell kerchief and mask and wipes and some garbage. Mm. Let me tell them something. Me, I am going to push a piece of other things that Marcus Garvey did. Marcus Garvey's spirit run up in me. You hear me yeah. tell them that? Watch it up. Because as of today, every Jamaican, we're going to start a protest in our country. We're going to support black owned businesses. Black owned businesses jamaican black owned businesses a time for jamaicans start to live up every day we have to sit on a loop of white man and chinese man and feel that it is okay and listen to a prime minister who is a thug eh, and watch the corruption in our face and watch over 1500 jamaicans get murdered per year 31 jamaicans got murdered between the period of march 9 and march and march 16 and we're comfortable one more picnic gone missing one more girl gone missing from very technical high school I don't understand how pity them is being, you pity them are go to um, human trafficking, organ harvesting. I don't know where I'm going. There's an organization that Jamaica will take where they are pity them. And the world will sit down and think, say, country around good. 151 parents can't find them pity from last year. And already this year, we've had more than 10 pity. My God, what we know about. A year not done yet. All the things in the country is good. I don't understand. Me is a father. I'm here at Pitney. And let me tell you something. You know. Let me tell you something. You know. You said this is a country. I want to go check my name. Go check my name for tax office. Me is a registered taxpayer. 
You see, any all my people go miss me in this. Me na ask you no. Me na ask. Me na ask you because no parliamentarian child is going missing, and their relative kids are not going missing. And the average Jamaican that will lose their money in a bank every day, and their pitney are going missing, and the country sit down like an idiot at about green and at about orange, green or orange. Who knows it's a green or orange? Mash up the whole country. Green or orange, PNP and Labour, right? mash up the whole country. And we are not protected. Our kids are not safe. Our kids are not safe. The time you are by 100 bus to go run taxi, you are taking 100 bus and start to transport our kids to school and have a bus system. Don't tell me so we can't do it. We should have had an Alamanda alert and up and up on every Jamaican phone. But as one pitney go missed on the report, everybody get to right across the country. And we start, we start that nationwide watch. We need to watch for Pitney then. You think a good thing right now, the parents for the young lady at Very Technical High School now have a damn clue where they're 16-year-old eh? hmm? You know how much Jamaican's are born when they know where they're Pitney On a table of good governance. On a table of prime minister. On a just, yo, on a top in eyes, yo. Andre, I can't remember your program now because let me, me tell you something now. Jamaican on a understanding now. On a understanding now. We feel, we feel the pain at Jamaicans where we listen to gunshot every night, you know. We feel the pain at Jamaicans where we're hungry, you know. We feel the pain at Jamaicans who kill us to them pitney tonight. Then say empty bed, empty bed in their house tonight because they're pitney gone. And you can't, well, well I'm going to ask you something. So if we are trafficking the kids out of the country, only know who own the port? Only know who own the port? Chinese again, who own the damn port? We don't have no control over our banking system because the banking system is privately owned. We don't have no control over nothing because all our businesses are privately owned. The beach them privately owned. The roads are privately owned. We don't have a country done. We don't have the two party, PMP and Labour rights, sell out the whole country. Jamaica on the start time to wake up. Wow. You're done here, man. Me done talk. Yes, ma'am.